Well, sustainable technology starts from how you design products. And Epson being a company sort of steeped in innovation, steeped in tradition, um, we look at our products not in terms of how we're designing products for the use, but not only the use, but also how we would get rid of them at the end of the product life cycle. And sustainability is at, at, at our core, and we have our vision 2050 in terms of um, sustainability. And this encompasses, really, when you look at our printing technology, we've moved away completely from laser in this part of the world, and particularly in the Middle East, and we've been, transitioned our entire product portfolio to ink-based technology. And our micro piezo uh, heat-free inkjet technology enables us to achieve a much lower cost per page, a much lower um, cost of ownership as well, due to the fact that we don't only just save cost on the ink side of the, of the house, but we also save a lot of um, cost in terms of power, and also in terms of low intervention printing. Um, with the less moving parts that, that um, ink-based ink ink printers have, it makes us um, much more reliable and requiring less interventions from, from service engineers. And then we have a suite of products that we wrap around this in terms of contactless printing solutions, how we would be able to monitor the, the printing solution from a remote site, as well as being able to allow um, the, the um, IT administrators to be able to um, control how you print. That when you go to the printer, you're only going to get the print the print jobs that you printed, removing waste on 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 the printer itself. And then if we look at Paper Lab, and that is a, a way in which we can complete the circular economy with being able to take used paper and recycle it into new paper within your own corporate environment. We, we really look at it from, from a point of view of two things. One, how are we, able, are we able to address our customers and partners during this period of time? And looking not only just to, then again at, at how we address our partners and customers, but how we address our supply chain. At Epson, we manufacture and um, own a lot of our supply chain across the world. And we were very quickly able to move ca capacity of, of production away from countries which were deeply affected by COVID to countries where, which are less affected, which enabled us to really keep the supply chain of products moving quite efficiently, as well as then moving our staff into um, remote look or their home office locations, enabling us to address the customers and partners um, through virtual environments. We've run a series of trainings, we've run customer events, um, all virtually during this time to make sure that we're keeping customers aware of what we're doing and keeping our partners aware of how we're able to address their needs in this time. Well, I think the, the, the most important thing about Jitex and, and our presence at Jitex is the fact that it is the 40th um, anniversary of the event. And we felt it extremely important that we be present at the hall, um, not only just from a, from a support for the region and a support for, for, for Jitex as, as, a, as a brand, but more importantly, to show customers that we can come back to, to, to work, we can come back into these um, contact environments where um, we can meet we, in a socially distanced manner, we can show products, we can show solutions, and we can really connect um, together in, in Jitex as we have done for the last 40 years. So it's very important for us to be here. Well, the predictions for 2021 is I can only hope that uh, with all of the discussions around vaccines is that this brings an, an elevation in terms of being able to get back to normal or what, whatever the new normal will be. Um, but in, from a product and, and, and um, brand perspective, again, innovation is at our core. We're going to continue to innovate on some new products. You're going to see new products on not only consumer print, business print, projection, or our wearable and, and robotics products. So we're still gonna bring a lot of new products to market next year. There's a lot more move towards contractual printing um, and we're developing new services and capabilities and service capabilities around uh, managed print services. And I think that'll only enable us to really embed that message about sustainability um, and how we can take cost away from printing and you can drive into doing other activities within your business and hopefully instill some growth in this region. Well, digital transformation it more looks at how do, we, how do we take data and how do we take our office processes and make them efficient 
right? And, and within a digital environment, and where do we on-ramp or off-ramp with, with, our, with our print technology? And if you look at our, our, our scanner portfolio, we've just introduced a brand new A3 scanner into our product portfolio, and it's a, a high-speed high A3 device, which gives us, when we talk about paperless office as well, right? Paperless office is obviously a concept which the UAE is looking at very strongly, and we see it as an opportunity to talk, more talk about document management, and where do we input paper, and where do we output paper. There's still going to be a requirement for a piece of outputted printed paper. It's just where is it, how is it, and how do we manage it? And through, as I said, a lot of the solutions that we have and uh, management solutions, we can better manage that with customers. We can show them how to do it in a sustainable manner as well as in a cost-effective manner.